Hey guys, how is everything going? Let's take a look at number 78, subsets. We're given a set of distinct num inter integers, nums, return all possible subsets. The power set, the solution set must not contain duplicate subsets. Okay, nums, output. Okay, so actually we did this before. We are going to search all the possible solutions which mat uh, matches our request. request. Uh, for this case, the final result would be a set of a, a one-dimensional one-dimensional array. Uh, so the result is simple. We don't need to keep a global array. We just to pass down uh, the temporary result together with our recursion functions, right? We just uh, basically we have two parameters. The first one is uh, the the temporary result. So the next one is possible uh, new digits. So we just pick one from the uh, the, 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 the available digits and put it to the temporary result and that is one, our, one of our subsets. When there is no digits available then the recursion is done, right? So let's do it. Okay, so the final result would be array. Now I'll create a walk method. I like to call it walk and the temporary result and the, the rest is available digit which is called, I'll call it a rest. Okay. Uh, when we are f when we are done with the walk method, we will walk the temporary. The first one it would be empty, right? The rest would be nums, and then we will return results. So we just uh, need to finish the walk method. So for every walk, it is a possible subset. So results push temp. And now what we did is uh, need to pick one from the rest then go on right so for let i zero i smaller than rest dot length we will walk the new temp temp would be concat concatenation concat concat uh rest i the rest would be uh, the rest would be okay. We need to uh, keep it from duplicates. We 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 would pick the number, uh, keep the numbers after right. The after them is available. If I pick now, we have picked two. Then one would not be available because it is already traversed by when we pick one. So we only pick numbers after them. So it would be rest slice I plus one and. Uh, it should be done. Let's say the time. Yeah, accept it. So the time will be say there is n, n. Uh, we oh, it's fast. It's fast enough. Okay, we won't need it. Time, we don't. We won't need, need to improve. The time will be we will actually traverse for, for this uh, loop method, right? It will generate two, two to the power of n subsets. So the time will be like this. The uh, space also, yeah, space two. Actually, for this problem, we can do some in, in, uh, in improvement. You see that we slice, right? We only do the slice here. Actually, we can reduce the use of the slice method. We can just say the start index, right? For here, we only want to know when, where we should start, which is the i. So, actually, the i would I'll just say start from zero, and this will be start index, and the i will start from uh, i should be start from start, right? And then I smite this, and then we should pass it on to i plus one. It should also work, and we remove the use of uh, slice. Which, hmm? Wait a minute, I s what, what's the problem? Rest is not defined, oh, my bad, it should be nums, nums. So here, uh, for way uh, a manipulation in JavaScript, we can use a slice, we can avoid, but in, in uh, in C or C++, I don't know, maybe it should be counted as extra uh, cost. We can submit it. I think it doesn't help that much, but... Uh, well, 20% and uh, it just... Uh, I think I, it could be 
uh, regarded as uh, random, like uh, not that the time would not be that uh, accurate. Okay, that's all for this problem. Hope it helps. Uh, hope to see you soon. Bye bye.